Now I am taking another example of rationalization. If I ask you what is the simplest rationalizing factor of cube root of 9? This is cube root of 3 into 3, 3 into 3. Here order is 3, so we need what? We need one more 3. So, if I multiply it by cube root of 3, this will give me cube root of 3 into 3 into 3. So, this gives us answer final as 3. So, what comes? We get a number which is rational. So, you can say the SRF of cube root of 9 is cube root of 3 and its reciprocal SRF of cube root of 3 will be what? Cube root of 9. Because when we know multiplication of A into B or B into A is same, that's why the SRF of cube root of 9 is cube root of 3 and cube root of 3 is cube root of 9. Now I am taking one more example where I will ask you to rationalize the denominator. Suppose I want to say that is 5 upon cube root of 16. 5 upon cube root of 16 bring it in the simplest form. Simplest form means there should be no irrational number in its denominator. So first of all I will change this cube root of 16 in its simplest form that is 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 1 2 3 4 so this become 2 to the 4 to the 8 to the 16 now this order is 3 so one of the pair of three same prime numbers will come out so this can be written as 5 upon 2 into cube root of 2 5 upon 2 into cube root of 2 that is 2 into cube root of 2 is the simplest form of this cube root of 16. Now the question is we want to remove or we want to bring the denominator in the rational form. In the form of a number where denominator must be what a rational number. So in order to remove this cube root of 2 what we need cube root of 4. So if I ask you to multiply numerator and denominator both by what? cube root of 4. If I multiply by it what cube root of 4 in the denominator then numerator will also be multiplied by cube root of 4. Now question is why cube root of 4? The reason is because I have cube root of 2. There is one prime number 2. I need two more 2's under the same order. So two more 2's means 2 to the 4. So cube root of 4 into cube root of 4 this gives me 5 into cube root of 4 divided by 2 into cube root of 2 into cube root of 4 become cube root of 8 and cube root of 8 can be say as a number 2. So answer comes 5 cube root of 4 upon this is 2 into 2 become what? 4. So now the denominator is rationalized. So whenever any question is given to rationalize the denominator, we need to think for a simplest number. One very easy example, somebody says, what is the rationalized form of 3 upon, that is square root of 2. If you take this, you have to multiply numerator and denominator both by root 2. You will get to know that this is what 3 root 2 upon root 2 into root 2 is root 4 square root of 4 is 2 so this become 3 by 2 root 2 so this is the way when only single term in the denominator is given then we can multiply it with its SRF now I will take the problems of the binomial terms in the denominator